what's up it is Maso903 here and welcome back to another video in today's video I'm going to be teaching you guys how to download the uh, missing Gary's mod uh, I guess texture files which usually come with counter-strike source uh, for free so um, here's an example of what happens when you don't have the texture files uh, basically everything is pink and it has a bunch of error signs all over the place so today I'm going to be teaching, I'm going to be teaching you guys how to get rid of that and play the game and actually enjoy your time on it so let's get started Alright guys, before I get started, I just wanted to say be sure to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, because I'm on my way to 5,000 subscribers, and all help is appreciated. But other than that, let's get on with the video. So the first thing that you're going to want to do is go open up the description below and go to this download link. I'll have it in the description just to make it easier for you guys. Once you're over here, all you have to do is hit download and uh, pick where you want to download it. So I'm going to be doing it to my desktop. Uh, I already have it downloaded, so I'm not going to go through the time, but it's 700-ish megabytes. Yeah, it's 722 megabytes. So, I mean, the download can go quick or slow, depending on your internet speed. Once you've done that, there's not really much else you have to do. From there, just double-click it and let it unarchive. Alright, guys, so I just quickly skipped or kind of faded uh, past the whole unarchiving process because it took around a minute and I didn't want to waste your, guys your time. So um, basically once it's, once it's unarchived you're going to get this folder and it's going to have a bunch of files in it. So that's completely normal. From there what you're going to want to do is open up your finder and then click on go. And now once you're over here you're going to want to hold down the option key on your Mac and then a library window is going to open up. Here I'm going to show you guys one more time, pay attention. Uh, so I let go of option, the library thing goes away but when I hold it down the library comes here. So all you have to do is just click on library and from there, I like to categorize mine in like a list. It just makes it easier for me. But from there, click application support and then scroll down until you find Steam. Once you have Steam, what you're going to want to do is go to Steam apps and then from there go to common, Gary's mod and then hit Gary's mod one more time and from there hit add-ons. Now this is where all your add-ons would be. I don't have any but now what you're going to want to do is add your Counter-Strike source content into here and uh, once the file is basically done transferring um, all you have to do is reopen up uh, Gary's mod so I'm gonna quickly uh, open it up load up a server and just show you guys that I'm not missing any texture files anymore alright guys so as you can see I'm not missing any textures this is a different map but uh, the same thing goes for some reason I was under the ground but yeah so the same thing goes here, I'm not missing any textures, but if I didn't install that extra CSS uh, pack that you guys downloaded, then I'd be missing textures for sure. So that's basically it for the video guys, I hope this uh, increased your uh, gaming experience I guess for this game. But other than that, I hope you guys enjoyed the video, please be sure to hit that like button, share this video with your friends, and go ahead and hit that subscribe button if you haven't already, because I'm on my way to 5,000 subscribers and all help is appreciated. But other than that, I will see you guys in my next video, peace.